Last week on State Law TV News, we shared a story about big business and how they made a decision to value profits over the safety of their employees. Today we have a similar story. In the state of Texas, plan explosions are a relatively common occurrence. I spoke with Houston attorney Terry Bryan about this topic and his experience representing victims of plant explosions. Here is what he had to say. These big companies that own the chemical plants tend to minimize the nature and extent of the injuries. Typically what happens is they say, just shelter in place, and then a few hours later they'll say everything's fine, when in fact sometimes people are injured or even killed. We had one case involving a plant explosion in which the person who died in the plant explosion was not discovered for a period of three or four hours after the blast. In fact, the company waved the fire department off, said they could go home, and then they had to call them back and tell them that someone had actually passed away from the explosion. I can't imagine how a company could be unaware of the fact that a company employee died in an explosion at their plant and actually send the fire company away. What does that say about big business and their commitment to safety? Seems like we're having plant explosions every week now. There was one last week, and now there's another one this week. When you live in Houston, you have to be careful and be aware that something like that could happen at any time. Be aware that these companies all talk about safety, and it's my belief that that's all they do. They just talk about it, and the real safety issues are not addressed at these plants, and many times people are hurt because of the lack of safety in each particular plant. This is Cindy Speaker for State Law TV News.